Hello and welcome, I'm DDF Racer and today I'm finally going to be putting my Symmetech K2R rig together. Now this isn't going to be an instructional style video because Symmetech can do a much better job of explaining how to build one of these things than I ever could, but this is more going to be of a time lapse and edited kind of sequence just to show you what's involved in putting something like this together. But before we get started, I'm going to give you a look at what I'm using so far just to give you a bit of context as to how big of an upgrade this actually is. So here it is, my current rig for want of a better word. This is what I've used in every single video I've ever made on this channel. Now I've moved houses a couple of times and the chairs changed too because my old one snapped, but the desk has always stayed the same. Now it only cost me $30 from the tip shop and it's absolutely solid. Uh, I also drilled a couple of holes in the wood just to uh, make sure the Logitech G29 wheel and shifter stay in place. Now the Fanatec V3 pedals are under here resting on top of the box which my Oculus Rift CV1 came in all those years ago, so no, I wouldn't exactly describe it as sturdy. I've got the main monitor up here, again, that is resting on a box, with a cheapo Dell second monitor here for my extra stuff when I'm streaming, and the tower unit is tucked in behind here. Now, over to the left is my X52 Pro HOTAS, which doesn't get much use because of the screen and mouse and the shifter and I just haven't really got anywhere convenient to put it. It's a bit of a mess with cables everywhere and it's extremely cramped, especially with all these lights all over the place as well. Oh yeah, that big thing there? That's a spare LED ceiling light from work. They were just going to check it out, so I managed to pick it up for free. It's super bright, but also super diffuse, so it's perfect for getting a nice, soft, consistent light for this angle that you guys normally see. That thing over there leads to a scary place called the outside. So all of this makeshift setup does work, but it's not really ideal because it's not great on my back for the posture, sitting in that chair for hours and hours. And also my, my pedals, I, I can't use my pedals to the full extent because every time I try and press down, the whole base unit flips up because they're just not secure, they're not mounted to anything. I'm, I'm using a fraction of the force and the, the, the ability that I can actually put into those pedals and they're designed for. But there is one thing I do want to say before I do get started. The Symmetech K2R rig does not come with a seat, it's just a frame. So big thanks to Mrs. DDF for picking up an actual car seat for me from the local Autobahn store one day after work. She's an absolute hero and I couldn't be doing this without her. And I couldn't be doing this without you guys. Obviously your continued support of the channel is fantastic and all of your donations on stream, all of your channel memberships, all of your behind the scenes, just ways of saying thanks on PayPal. Just, it's fantastic, it really is guys. Your support is amazing and I genuinely just would not be putting this thing together if it wasn't for you. So let's get stuck in.
in we have a seat and a frame and the seat took the majority of that so time to get all the attachments and build the rest of it it's getting pretty late I'm getting pretty tired so I think I might not do it all today we'll see how we go but I might have to do the computer tomorrow So that's all the attachments done now. And it's getting pretty late. It is currently 11.20 p.m. Mrs. DDF's gone to bed, so I'm gonna have to start being nice and quiet. But I've still got a monitor stand to make, so better get that done, then off to bed. We'll do all the computer stuff tomorrow.
done for now. The monitor mounts are on and the PC stand are on as well. It's currently 1am in the morning and considering I've been up since 4 to do the VEC race, I think, I think it's time for bed. Let's carry on with this tomorrow guys. Approximately six hours later. Let me finish my coffee first though.
Okay, so there we go. It's finished. A Symatec K2R rig with all the trimmings. Now, I'm not going to go in and do a race now, guys, because I'm absolutely exhausted. I've got a very sore pair of knees and a very sore back. So I'm going to have to take it easy for the rest of the day. But I will be doing some races over the next few days. So make sure you subscribe to the channel and stay tuned to see me put this into action. And if you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to leave it a like and share your thoughts in the comments below, guys. I'd love to hear what you think and whether you enjoyed this, whether it gives you a good idea of what it's like to put one of these things together. But yeah, like I said, check out the channel over the next few days to see this actually get used, see me dial it in with the pedal positions, the seat, all the camera stuff, all that kind of thing. And just look after yourselves, really. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you real soon.